Fluorescent lamps are about four times as efficient as old-fashioned incandescent light bulbs. And although LEDs are even more efficient, fluorescent lamps are still very common. But how do they actually work? Fluorescent lights come in many different shapes and sizes, but for now let's just take the most basic design. It consists of a glass tube. On both sides of the tube there's an electrode. The electrodes look like the filament of an old light bulb. Inside the glass tube there's a mixture of mercury vapour and an inert gas. Also, there's a special coating on the inside of the tube. More about that later on. Now when the lamp is turned on, an electric current starts running through both of the electrodes. This makes the electrodes heat up, and you'll see why that's necessary in just a moment. After that, a high voltage is applied between the two electrodes, and as a result of that, negative particles, aka electrons, will start escaping the negative electrode and fly towards the positive electrode through the tube, since obviously positive attracts negative. The reason why we needed to heat up the electrodes first was because that way the electrons can escape the electrode more easily. It is possible to make the lamp work without heating up the electrodes, but then we'd need a much higher voltage. Sometimes these flying electrons collide with mercury atoms inside the tube. When this happens, the mercury atom becomes excited. This means that there is now more energy inside the mercury atom than usual. The mercury atom is now going to get rid of this energy since that is what particles do. Particles always want to have as little energy as possible. So now how is this excited atom going to get rid of its energy? Well, it does so by emitting some electromagnetic radiation. And that electromagnetic radiation is what we call light. But hold on a second, we're not there yet. The light emitted by the atoms is invisible UV light. And sometimes that's great because for some reason you might need UV light, but we cannot use it to illuminate a room. This is where the special coating on the glass tube comes in. The coating absorbs the UV light and re-emits it as visible light. This process is called fluorescence, hence the name of the lamp. So there you go. Now you know how fluorescent lamps work. I hope you've enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.